Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to talk more about fruit trees. So today I want to share with you a method that I've been using to uh, grow uh, scions from uh, seeds and then graft them. So uh, I've grown uh, apples in soil as well as hydroponic and guys the hydroponic way is so much faster. So here is an apple tree that I took from here because I grew uh, a bunch of them. I just dropped a bunch of seeds into a pot and then they all grew. So these are all the seeds that I, um, I dropped and so this one grew and that one grew and then we have a few more that kind of started later. And then this one here, I started, these are all different varieties. Uh, these are the same, and this is the same. Uh, but somehow the color uh, is a little bit different. I'm not sure why. It could be because, um, uh, you know, you, you never know what you're going to get when you grow an apple tree from seeds. Uh, the reason is that uh, it could use a different pollinator. It could use a crap apple as a pollinator. So when you grow it, you could get a crap apple tree. So that's the thing with... Um, growing apple from seeds you just never know what you're gonna get but also it may take forever for the tree to fruit and so that is one reason why people don't grow from seed but today i'm going to share with you a reason why you should grow from seed and have fun along the way so uh, that is through grafting and so uh, i've been grafting pears and apples for the past few years and i've been you know have had such great success because uh, of you know things that I do here I use it to practice and so uh, these here once it's grown to this size this is a perfect time to cut this as, to use as scion wood and so I'm going to show you one that I've done already and uh, you'll be amazed at how fast it grows once you graft it onto a mature tree okay so here is my multi grafted apple tree and the scion wood that I mentioned earlier is this one right here you see how big this um, this tree is or this branch is it is pretty big and as big as the original other grafts that I've done and this scion wood was taken off of this tree right here you see this tree here look how small that is so here is the initial cut so I cut it right there to take the scion wood you see the leaves are very much the same so this is the uh, the tree that I took the wood off to put here and look at how massive this thing is and um, the thing with doing grafting uh, of uh, varieties that you grow from seed is that you can have a tree already with fruits and stuff like that. You see, I have fruits right here. While you wait for this to grow because you, you're you not going to know how long it's going to take for these to fruit. And so if you graft it onto a, another tree, then the time that you spend waiting may not be as bad because you may not even remember that you grafted uh, the one that you grew from seed and then in the meantime you have all these other apples to enjoy while you wait so instead of just growing the the, the seed and then wait many many years for the tree to become mature and produce you just graft that a piece of the tree that you grew from seed onto another apple tree that way you have apples already while you wait for this to grow and so this here I'm not sure when it's gonna fruit because uh, uh, nothing yet for it this year but look at how massive the trunk is you see that the graph was right here and now it's, it's becoming part of the tree and it's getting pretty big while the original tree remained pretty small so I think grafting uh, a, a young tree onto a mature tree helps it grow faster because the mature tree has an established root system it can take up nutrients and it can spread it around and then you can put it to uh, the new young grafted tree so the ones that I be growing from seed different varieties I'm gonna be grafting it onto some of these sides over here look my my bunny right here he comes over and just hang out all day long uh, sometimes in the afternoon uh, I come out and water he just you know just hangs out and just <laughs> he doesn't care that I'm here but anyway so like this here so I'll graft it onto here 
and then that one would grow and then I'll have fruit in the meantime while I wait for those guys to grow I may even forget about them so I just have to make sure I label them correctly so that is the ideas guys so grow your apple tree from seed uh, grow it in hydroponic you can speed it up and then take the scion wood and graft it onto your mature tree um, now you will have an apple tree that is multi grafted with all kinds of different varieties and then you know leave one or, or two or whatever that uh, is already mature and you know you can enjoy the fruits in the meantime while you wait for these um these grafted scions to grow and then you never know what you're going to get as they mentioned because apples could be you know pollinated by many different kinds of apples and so what you think you're going to get from the seed may be completely something else so uh, it's the luck is a luck of a draw and so we'll just have to be surprised by that so anyway uh, if you want to see more uh, on these uh, you know uh, grafted trees or branches from seed in the future uh, and see what kind of fruits uh, they will come out as uh, just leave a comment and then I will try to make videos in the future covering this subject again and then you we may see the fruits together so anyway thank you so much for watching and I hope that will give you ideas to uh, do you know some fun projects with your fruit trees and please subscribe